Eight, eight acres, I think it is, of stubble to do. Um, I'm with Lee, you see him in the background over there. There he is, digging his holes. <laughs> um, yeah, we've just got this little stubble field to do while we're waiting for all that crop over there to be taken off. Hopefully in the next couple of weeks we'll get that as well. But um, yeah, hopefully we'll find something decent there. You never know. Um, I don't think there's been much found here before, but we'll have a little look around and see what we can find. And I'll see you on the first good target. All right, see you soon. All right, here we go, people. We've got the first decent signal. I think it's just the button. I won't show all the buttons, but yeah, it's the first one for the day. Nothing special about that. Just standard button. All right, hope we'll find something better soon. All right, see you on the next. The next one is just a little shotgun, shotgun cartridge end, whatever you want to call it. Shotgun cartridge. All right, on to the next. All right, just found this little bit. Um, not a clue what it is. Not a thought I'd show it, in this case anybody out there knows what it is. Uh, I don't know, got a little bit of green patina on there. Not sure. Anybody got any ideas? Put it in the comments for me. But yeah, I don't know. Last few targets have been shotgun shells, so not really been much else since then. Right. Yeah, anybody knows? Put it in the comments. See you on the next one. Right, I had a really nice signal here, but it's just a little broken piece of an old toy car. It's the back end. Not very interesting. Alright, on to the next. Alright guys, look at this. I'm with Lee, who've been here for about an hour, and he's just got his first ever hammered. Look at that. That's quite a nice condition one as well, once it's cleaned up. I think I can see Edward around there somewhere. Long cross. Oh, sorry, I'm going out of focus. Yeah, long cross. Probably Edward, one of the Edwards, loads of them. But yeah, Lee's first ever hammered. He doesn't want to be on camera, but he's well happy. He's dancing around. He's loving it. Nice one, Lee. Well done. Right. All right, guys. We've got a good signal here. Coming up about 83, 84, I think it is. If you can hear that. Have a little look in this clod. Oh, no, it's not in there. It must have fallen out. It's in here somewhere. Ah, I can see it. Musket ball. <laughs> Always give off a good signal, don't they? Yeah, that's quite a nice one. Quite a big one. Lovely. All right. I'll see you. See you on the next one. All right. Just got this little bit here, guys. Um, I think it might be maybe part of a buckle or something. Uh, got some sort of design on there. And if you can actually see that. Yeah, it's got some markings on there. I think. Maybe a hole would have gone through there, maybe it's like the, I don't know, might be part of a buckle, I'm not sure, that's what it looks like to me, it's a buckle fragment. Cool, alright, see you in a bit. Alright guys, I've got one here that sounds like it's quite near the surface, if you can hear that, so I'm going to try and, try and do a bit of a live one. Um, shouldn't be too far, it sounded like it was quite shallow. Yep, still here somewhere. I'll get the pinpointer out. Ah, uh, a bit of tin can, a bit of aluminium, oh well, never mind, on to the next. Right, I could be wrong here, but I don't, I think this could be silver. 
it's definitely got a silver look to it. It's silver milled. Let's have a look. Could be like a sixpence or something. Oh, what's that? Yeah, a little sixpence, yeah. Sorry, I was right the first time. What's that? 19... Uh, I think it's 1943. Yeah, that's not bad. It's pretty chewed up, but never mind. Right, see you on the next one. Right, the next one, guys, is a little thimble. Quite a nice one, actually, nice condition. So it's got some age to it, a little beehive one. Not, can't really remember what the ages are now, to be honest. But yeah, it's quite nice. Nice little thimble. See you on the next. Right, peeps, Lee has had another little find. A nice little Roman there. I think it's Emperor Constantine. It's lovely, it's right near the car as well. We just stopped for some lunch and he found it just, I don't know, maybe like 20 metres over there, not far. He's having a great day. You can see it there, nice bit of detail that side. It's got a bit of corrosion on that side, but it's nice. Well done, Lee. He's having a good day. Hopefully I'll find one soon. Right, see you on the next. Alright, this is about as good as it's got for the last hour or so. A little bit of bronze. I've had loads of bits of bits of rubbish, bits of coke. Um, just random bits really. It's quite a bit quiet, to be honest, since Lee found that Roman, not much else has come up. But I'm working the area where there's a lot of iron, trying to work between the iron, see if there's any more Romans hanging around. So, see you on the next one. Alright, we've got a coin or button situation going on. Let's see what it is. You reckon coin or button? Um, let's have a look. Oh. Definitely a coin. Um, I think that's a modern one, isn't it? Yeah, I can't quite see what it is at the moment. Um, yeah, I'm not sure about that. It's definitely some sort of a modern one, but I can't tell what it is at the moment. I'll let you know if I find out what it is. Lovely. Right, on to the next one. Right, here's the next one. Nice little bag seal. Got some sort of mark on there. Um, yeah, I can't tell what it is, but it's pretty old, a few hundred years old maybe. It's a nice, nice little bag still. Right, on to the next. Well, I've had loads of buttons today, but this is definitely one of the better ones. Got like a little tree on there or something. Uh, most of them have been just plain boring old buttons I haven't bothered filming. But there's that one. It's not too bad. Right, on to the next. Right, that's my first buckle of the day. Very old, rusty one. Don't know what the age of that would be. It's quite old though. Not bad. Um, yeah, it's about two o'clock now. Probably got a few hours left, two or three hours. I've been here since about half nine. I mean, I haven't really found nothing too exciting, but these had a hammered and a Roman, so there's definitely stuff on here. Um, yeah, this field is only like eight acres. But we're just doing this until the, you can see over there, all that barley sugar crop is coming off in a couple of weeks. It's about 100 acres over there. So the farmer said we can come back and have a go at that. And we said we'd just do this little stubble field for now. It's been stubble for about a year, so the stubble's really flat and rotten. Um, yeah, so there's a few bits on here. Lee's had his hammered and a Roman. I've had a couple of little bits, nothing too exciting. But yeah, hopefully we'll find some more before we go in. Alright, see you on the next one. And another musket ball. Little tiny one this time. Right, moving on. Right guys, Lee's just shouted out hammered again. And he's got a little cut quarter. Let me just get it in the sunlight. There you go. Look at that. It's lovely that is. A tiny little piece of hammered. That's the Deus Program 9, Program Hot. He's just found that. A tiny little piece. 
he's gone from having his first hammered to having a hammered and a cut quarter and a Roman. All in one day. Nice one. All right, see you in a bit. All right, guys, I just found this. I don't know what it is. I just found it before Lee shouted hammered. Um, yeah, it looks like he's got some age to it, though. Nice little patina on it. Lee's having all the luck today. He's got the hammers and the Romans, so I'll make do with little bits like this, I suppose. It's about time you had a bit of luck. Right, I'll see you on the next one. Right, this one probably would have just been just part of an old buckle, I think. Got about an hour left now. Getting a bit tired. It's bloody hot today, so it's hard work. Um, yeah, so hopefully find something good before we go. Right, see you in a bit. Right, here's the next one, guys. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. It's like a, it's like a, I don't know, something to do like a keyhole or something, I'm not sure. Nice patina on it though, so it might have a bit of age. Anybody knows, stick it in the comments for me. On to the next. Alright guys, this one looks like it could be something interesting. I'm not sure what, might be part of a, I don't know, a brooch or something. It's got a little hole going through the side there. It's got a sharp point at the end. Um, yeah, I don't know. If anybody knows what that is, put it in the comments for me, please. I haven't not got a clue. But it looks like it could be something. This is on the same part of the field where um, Lee found his Roman coin, so I'm hoping it might be something to do with Roman. I don't know. But if you know, put it in the comments, please. Cheers. Right, guys, that is the end. Finished. Um, yeah, we've done quite well. Actually. Well, Lee done quite well. Got his hammered. First ever hammered for Lee. Well done. A cut quarter and a little Roman. I think you got part of a crotal bell as well. A few other little bits. So yeah, done all right. It's a good day. We'll be coming back here once the, um, the crops off. Um, yeah, looking forward to coming back here. I reckon there's a lot more finds to be found. So yeah, looking forward to it. All right, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. See you on the next one.